Welcome to the Saguamigan Nicolay National Forest's Laurel Lake Campground. I'm kind of on the edge of the forest here. Um, we've got two small loops, one through seven with a boat ramp, and another section, nine through 12. We'll check those out. These are reservable on recreation.gov. Some of the sites are, I'm gonna list which ones are. Other ones are not reservable. They are a first come first serve basis. And even the reservable ones, if you show up and they are not blocked off for the days that you want to stay, you can book those sites. And those sites are only $15 a day, $7.50 if you have your Golden Age Pass. So let's go take a look at these sites. And the water source here is an old Baker pump made in Evansville, Wisconsin. Now, before I show you the first loop here, sorry about this. The second loop, I actually have to go out to the main road and catch it. It is not connected internally. So let's hop through these first rounds. One, first come, first serve. Bent as a tent site. You see a little pad up top for that. Two, first come, first serve. And just so you know, around here we are surrounded by private property. So there are uh, people driving around on the roads here. Uh, we're not deep in the woods. Two here, it's fairly long. If it works for you, grab it. The next couple are reservable as we get closer to the water. So site three here is reservable, no current reservations on it. You've got a stump back there that is sort of your stop point, but it's really meant as a tent pad over on the right. Four over here is pretty small. Again, a tent pad, and these tent pads are kind of mossy right now. This is very slopey out here. Five reservable seems fairly large, actually. It's quite a bit of room there. Very wide, very open, except where the fire pit is. Six where the schoolie is here. Um, long pad here, first come, first serve, and then a side section for the tents. Seven is reservable, and this is closer to the water. I have a feeling with the sign here, if there was a camp post, they would be in seven, but they're not. Fairly long, but don't park on the tent pad. Eight, first come, first serve, not too long, fairly compact. All right, down here at the boat launch, before I hop in the vehicle and drive over to the other spot, this is definitely set up. Nice place to go paddling, I think. It looks a very contained, at least right here on the lake. I think the lake gets much bigger when you get out further, but you could paddle nicely in this area. And it has these beautiful yellow iris down here. Okay. Um, as I mentioned, there are private residences around here. You're seeing the entire rest of the campground here. But you're hearing the leaf blower of the neighbor. However, Site 9 here um, is reservable. And it's a waterfront site. It's fairly short here. Got your tent pad, but you have access down to the water. And they usually, I've seen on other sites, they don't want you putting your tent beyond the designated area. All right, 10, reservable. We got someone in here right now. Squeezed on the other side of the tree there. So it's a little dance around trees to use that site. They had to go way over, a little on the tent pad. This area, it hit the big tree behind the uh, truck. Site 11, reservable. This is a very nice one. It goes back quite a bit. This one's a little deeper than the last one. And it backs up to the water as well. So, waterfront camping. 
and site 12 here reservable again right on the water right on the marshes it's a good breeze today it's chilly I don't have any bugs but I'm curious if it does get buggy with that beautiful spot right next door this is where your tent goes and it's a little hooky into here and that is the entire campground two distinct sections to it um, they are not close together there's a big chunk of marsh I don't even see that bunch of woods over there it's beyond that where the other section is each one has its own water source and porta potty or pit toilet so thanks for coming along on this short little trip check out Laurel Lake Campground I'm in Laurel Lake Campground area 2 right now if that is a reference on the recreation.gov site I don't know I have a whole playlist series of the Shawamig and Nicolay National Forest campgrounds I've done almost all of the campgrounds on the eastern side of northeastern side of Wisconsin I also have an entire other list of all the state parks in Wisconsin and all those campgrounds so check out that playlist here um, thanks for coming along on this little trip a little tour I'll see you in the next one get on out there and watch out for deer <laughs>